With this settlement, we will rule a line under the contracts. Secondly, as part of the settlement, Australia will pay the Naval Group 555 million euros, which equates to around 830 million Australian dollars. This is a fair and an equitable settlement which has been reached. It follows as well uh, discussions that I've had uh, with uh, President Macron and I thank him uh, for those discussions and the cordial way in which uh, we are re-establishing a better relationship between Australia and France. It brings the total cost of the former government's failed policy to $3.4 billion. This is a saving from the $5.5 billion that Senate estimates was told would result from that program. I'm looking forward to taking up President Macron's invitation uh, to me uh, to visit Paris at the earliest opportunity and we'll make further announcements uh, are forthcoming about the dates in which that will occur. And I see a personal meeting between myself and President Macron uh, in France as being absolutely vital uh, to resetting that relationship, which is an important one for Australia's national interest. Thanks very much. Wang